much, Rick. Well, Treefort Music Fest kicks off this week, so whether you're a music fan, an artist, a movie snob, or a foodie, there is something for you. 13 forts to check out while you're at the festival. Today, we're learning about Hackfort. Joining us is Mike Taylor and Sean Weekly. And uh, of course, uh, there's a lot of great things happening at Treefort, but Hackfort, it's one of those things that people, they might not know what it is. So I guess for starters, what is Hackfort? Hackfort's the tech part of Treefort. It's, uh, it's been around for 10 years this wow. year. I'm very excited. Uh, it's basically a tech conference that takes place during the music fest. And it sounds like, you know, there's a lot of great things to get involved in uh, in terms of what people can look forward to, I guess, coming up this week. What's what's on tap for Hackfort? Yeah, and, you know, we have a ton of events. You know, we focus on having workshops. We have speakers from out of town. You know, and, and, and to, to mirror what Mike said, you know, we really, this event is really all about the community. It's about Boise. But, you know, we're also trying to focus on creating a space for people that they can really enjoy these events that work maybe in the tech community or maybe a little curious about technology. You know, we, but we also just want to have a lot of fun. It's a music festival after all. Yeah. I'm curious, with uh, a lot of people traveling from different areas, a lot of people from the Northwest, uh, I would imagine this is a, a time where people would be exchanging ideas and having conversations with maybe people they usually wouldn't get to. Right, yeah, and there's a lot of opportunities for that. Uh, there's a bunch of different panels on AI and VR and XR and all the R's. Uh, <laughs> there's some workshops, you know, like every two hours there's another workshop, essentially. Um, and then, yeah, some networking events as well. It's it's. There's really something for everyone. I appreciate lots of R's, lots of realities out there. <laughs> um, and one reality that actually I think we previewed a few weeks ago, Martha. When I say Martha, what yeah. does that mean at Hackfort? Martha is an uh, art project of donated e-waste that's getting built um, and going to be displayed at Hackfort. Uh, and e-waste is, you know, just old technology. It's not really used anymore. And then they're going to, you know, display it. And uh, it's... It's coming together. I've been I've been keeping my eye on it. Yeah, yeah my, Michael Blood. I think one really cool thing he just yeah. told me an update on that project is that he went to the the Boise Waste rem Removal Site and said, Hey, you know, I want to recycle this sculpture. You know, we're trying to promote e you know what to do with e waste, and they want him to actually not recycle it. They're going to take it and install it at their new e waste facility out there oh, after awesome. this project's done. So it's actually going to live on to kind of promote you know, what we're doing. So, so Martha will live. Okay, <laughs> I know that when Martha finally gets fully put together, we'll have to get some video and we'll do a real fun piece with that. But guys, thank you so much for being here on the News at Four. Of course, we will get all the info and all the schedules up online for you. Full guides online actually right now, ktbb.com. Or you can text the word tree fort, spelled exactly like you see it on your screen, to 208-321-5614. We'll send you that link directly to your phone. News at Four will be right back after this break. Thanks, Joe.